welcome guys to electrical control protection drawings part 2 I am your coach my name is Mohammad Kashif and I am electrical engineer by profession I have 16 plus years of experience purely in power system production I have various trainings from certification from semi in Saudi Arabia semi in Germany Erlangen and I have also uh, conducted uh, and taken training in Pakistan, uh, Wabda. Uh, I have been doing trainings in Saudi Arabia to Saudi Electricity Company. I have also conducted training in K-Electric in Pakistan and Germany also. So uh, let me introduce uh, about this course. Uh, this is part two uh, and I have also completed part one and that part one is from really basic level. Uh, from scratch so I will really suggest whoever is want to do part 2 please also visit part 1 and if there are gaps in your knowledge so I will suggest to please go to part 1 complete it and then you can come to part 2 if you you can decide so uh, the knowledge of protection uh, engineering uh, drawing and study I have found that it has own terminologies and these are not available in books so I found time and I thought that for the students uh, who want to learn and for the technician which are in the field and they want to learn. So I have uh, I will be producing this is part two, uh, several parts because protection engineering drawing is an, a very very uh, in-depth uh, subject. So uh, based on your uh, capacity or your uh, understanding you can uh, always choose the card so let me introduce you what is uh, included in this part so in this one uh, I have introduced how to read drawings using cross references um, it's like uh, a very very pivotal point in engineering drawing uh, it's just like uh, if you want to go to a place and discover that place you should know how to read the map so even you are not understanding which place is it but you should have a skill to navigate to understand and to move on within the map itself so that you can reach somewhere so this point is very important so I focus on it and I give a very long lecture on this that uh, how to read cross references how you can uh, move uh, from one reference one uh, equipment to another equipment and also have attached drawings so uh, I have uh, explained by some examples that how you can navigate between the drawings and you can find the cross references what are the internal and external equipments and panels okay then I have explained the uh, relay so my con uh, after finishing this my idea is to explain you the different components and how we are uh, using the terminology in our production systems uh, later on I have also explained what is circuit breaker and isolator and oxygen contacts these are uh, the most important and commonly used components so I have explained in detail and I have uh, pro uh, given the information and what is MCB I have explained in detail after that I have explained a tripping circuit and what is a tripping what is meaning of tripping what how tripping is different from opening of a circuit and what is a tripping circuit then I have explained CB trip and CB closing what is it after that I have explained what is closing and closing circuit uh, after that I have explained what is a lockout relay which is a very common relay in the protection system so it's also important to understand uh, everywhere I have explained first theory and try to explain through with letter diagram after that I have taken it to the real practical drawings of and substations with, uh, that will be available for download and, uh, and I have explained through those drawings after that uh, the next topic is covered is understanding closed block circuits so in some cases closing off circuit breaker is blocked so what are these cases and I, I, I know you, you like to 
uh, understand and it's really exciting topic uh, understanding watchdog contact uh, what is watchdog is doing here and uh, I will explain this this again this is a production uh, engineers terminologies so only production engineer can explain after that what is saline circuit or saline contact this is again I will tell you by example and I have uh, in this course I have uh, tried to explain clearly and with more examples so that you can uh, understand it nicely so I really uh, encourage to take this course because uh, engineering electrical engineering main uh, uh, expertise should be to understand the schematics uh, drawings so I hope you will enjoy this training and wish you best of luck.